Hello, it's Andy Graham of Hobo Traveler. I'm uh, waiting for the Internet Cafe to open. It's supposed to open at 10 o'clock. I think uh, it's 10.15 right now, so Croatia's on your basic... Uh, I'm in a really kind of a dumpy courtyard, <laughs> okay? It's kind of funny. Um, I wanted to make... I came over here to look at this. This thing says 2012 on it. They made this thing in 2012. I have no idea why they did it. And this is, to me, the serendipitous type of things that I get to look at. Uh, you know, there's there's a lot of curious things in the courtyard, even though it's really kind of dumb. But the reason why I'm making this video is I wanted to show you that... Uh, it's really pretty rough here, guys. Don't want to scare you off. Um... Making money with videos is, or a blog, a travel blog, is possible. The hard part is is that most of the travelers are on uh, endless vacation, okay, and they never, never can forego the pleasures long enough. You know, they have to be patient, and you have to you have to work, right? <laughs> and so. Uh, Right now, I'm probably going to wait. I'm going to blow off a half hour just trying to get copies. I have these questions that people send me, and I, I found that it's simpler to just print them off and then read them, and then I can go sit in a place that's nicer and try to show you some background while I'm doing it. But, uh, you know, you have to search for an Internet cafe. You have to do all these uh, things. And it increases the... Uh, it, it's not enjoyment, right? It's, it's work. And when a person goes on vacation, their problem is is that they they turn into this mode where everything's party and this is 99 percent of the travel bloggers that quit this is why uh... somebody's coming out on the porch but pretty much <coughs> the problem is is that you you've converted to party mode and you're no longer thinking about uh... how is it instead of working so you have to be really regimented you have to have a very good routine and you have to be uh, almost not so interested in everything that you can forego the play long enough. And, and most people are so temptation-driven, temptation, temptation driven, they can't do it. So I've seen a lot of travel bloggers that just, you know, they, they say it's too much work. But it's not really too much work. It's just that they were tempted too much by the play. I'll show you something interesting right here on the uh, as I close. Even in the wildest places, there's things to look at. You can see there's some grapes here. But if you're uh, trying to be a travel blogger, you have to have patience and work and have a very steady routine. <laughs>